Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to talk a bit about the sections of the home page. Um, so basically the slider, the carousel and the general news. Um, in one of the previous tutorials um, I teach you how to create posts. Um, so I went ahead and I created um, around between 5 and 7. Um, yeah, you see I created a couple of posts just to populate a bit the template. Um, so, to first of all, uh, to uh, to change um, the, the sections of the home page, we're going to go into the theme options, so our customization panel, uh, and then we are going to select um, we're going to select home page first. Um, so, in in the home page, uh, as you can see, we have two options, uh, two, well, two main sections. One is carousel and one is general news. So uh, let's go ahead and activate the carousel. Um, and basically, uh, the carousel is, uh, some, is the rotating posts that are underneath the slider. Uh, so, well, anyway, let's go and activate it. And then we select the amount of posts that we want to show. Let's say that we want to show four then the category that we want the post to to show um, which category of post we want to show which is we can select fantasy uh, as you remembered uh, we create fantasy shoot and slider but we decided the slider w uh, was only for the for the slider so let's say that we want to select category fantasy um, and then we can give you a, a different title if you want um, but at the moment, let's 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 leave it for news. But we we can change it if you want. Um, so let's go and save all changes. And all changes are saved. And let's go in the home page and we refresh the site. So we refresh, and you will notice that there's a new section appeared, which is the carousel. So here you will be able to um, to move between the between the posts. And you will also be able to uh, access the post by clicking on any of them. Um, so then, this is the carousel section. Then, and now let's talk a bit about the general news section, which it works really exactly the same as the carousel read. So let's go back into the admin panel, and we go into general news. <coughs> Here again, we uh, can uh, choose the amount of posts to show per page. Um, I think. Five is um, a nice number. Uh, it kind of, you know, uh, it kind of have a, a nice, um, nice uh, page uh, feeling. Obviously, maybe you have the sidebar you wanted like um, you you have a, like a longer sidebar or a shorter sidebar, so you want to add more or less. Um, <clears throat> maybe three is better for you. Um, so you know we can do that if you want. Um, so anyway, you can uh, select the amount of posts you want to show. Again, you want to you can select the category, um, and you can change the title again. So maybe instead of general news, you can change uh, to I don't know uh, latest latest news. Uh, this doesn't matter. It doesn't need to be capitalized. So I just writing like with different uh, um, I mean yeah, I'm writing with like capital letters and not so just to show you that it doesn't matter so let's change the title and click save and then we go back to here and if you notice now it says general news but when we refresh the page hopefully it will say latest news so as you can see it says latest news now um, so this is uh, set up and the last part is the um, is the slider. So to change the slider we have to go back into theme options and we go into the slider tab. The slider tab we have two options. One is the parallax slider which is the one that we have at the moment and is the default one and the other option is the tab slider. Um, so we want to uh, select uh, the one that you want. Uh, let's select the tab slider now, so you see the different change. And then you can also select the post category. So the same as um, 
as the carousel and the general news, you can select the category uh, that you want, which post you want to show. So uh, we kind of said that we only show, we create a category called slider to show that post. So let's uh, select slider. And then here, um, it's just uh, for the image count, uh, it's just for a parallax. So let's say that instead of tab slider, we select parallax. Uh, and you want to show only five posts, then you can give it a number. Uh, but at the moment, we are going to select, select tab slider. Um, the only reason because tab slider has no image count is because uh, we only uh, have three. You cannot have more than three because if not, it will break, break the design. So let's go and click save all changes. And when we refresh, you should have a tab. So now, as you, as you can see, the slider changes and it changes into uh, the tab slider. So uh, I just want to quickly show you about the parallax um, count. So uh, let's say that we want only to show only uh, three. Then you can click Save All Changes. And here now it will come back into a parallax slider with only three options. You can see one, two, three. Um, and imagine that you want to show only two. Then change to two and you save all changes and you refresh and issue only show two. So this concludes this tutorial um, and I will see you in the next one.